In this video, you will learn how to change the color of lines in multiple line graph. You can see here I have changed these color of these three lines, which have different colors. So in this tutorial, I will explain how you can conditionally change this color according to your requirement. So let's start this tutorial. In a separate sheet, I have already entered the data. So firstly, I will insert a line graph, select this data. go to insert tab and here you will find the option of line graph select this one now i will place it here and resize it for your convenience and remove these grid lines so it is more visible for you if you are interested for conditional formatting of this graph, then you can watch my other videos. In this video, I will only explain how you can change the color of these lines. Firstly, if you want to change the color scheme of these lines, there is another, a simple option. Go to this change color option and you can select any color scheme. And secondly, if you want to change the uh, color of individual lines according to your requirement, then there is a separate method. So let's start second method. Firstly, select that line which you want to change the color of this line. Right click and here you will find the option of format data series. Select this option and select this bucket option. In bucket option, you will find the option of line. Click solid line and in color you can select any color for example yeah, i want to change color to red so you can see here the color is changed to red similarly if you want to change the color of this second line for example i want to change this color to green i will click on this line you can see here the circle appear appeared here which indicate that the line is selected right click go to format data series option select this bucket and from here in line click solid line and color select green similarly if you want to change the color of this one select this one and from here you can change the color to anyone for example purple and the color is changed that's the end of this tutorial thanks for watching this video goodbye